Hello YouTube, I am making this video to thank all of you fellow Improbabulites for 500 subscribers. And yes, I did call you Improbabulites, because that's what Justice Keeper Hero likes to call his fans. But enough about that, it's time to address some comments I found in the internet. People are asking who made the YouTube poop that I posted. And that would be me. I made that video myself, because I wanted to bring more purpose to this channel than just a re-upload station. All of the original Improbables episodes are made by the Improbables, not me. Which is also, why I make no money from them, because I only monetize content that I make, like these thank you videos, and any YouTube poops and remaster cuts, compilations, top tens, etc. that I post on this channel. Which reminds me, regarding the comments. I get so many requests for season 3, as well as other videos for the Improbables to react to. Please direct those comments to the actual Improbables, because I'm just a fan, like all of you. But I also noticed some of you people going on to the Improbables channel, going to Justice Keeper Heroes latest videos, and spreading the word about this channel. I'm actually glad you did that, hopefully I'll get some answers on, how they feel about the situation. I'm excited that over 500 of you and counting have subscribed to this channel to watch the classic Improbables videos, as well as any remasters and YouTube poops that I make based on them. However, at the same time, it also kind of scares me. Because the actual Improbables have 900 subscribers, meaning that my subscriber count is quickly rising up to that of the real thing. That is insane! But anyways, now I feel kind of selfish saying you'd have to wait for 1000 subscribers to get some hints about my identity, considering the actual Improbables don't even have that many. So, what I decided to do about this, is give you some hints now, and then, if you still don't figure it out, I'll just totally reveal myself at the 1000 mark. So here are some hints. You can hear a sample of my actual voice in the YouTube poop that I made which is still on this channel, hint hint. YouTuber Mewtwo Overkill knows me in real life, because I was in one of his troll videos, and won't stop taunting me about it, not that I care. And finally, Raccoon Man on DeviantArt has made fan art of my actual channel at one point. I know those last two hints were kind of vague, but it gives you guys a chance to go exploring, and gives the two people I just mentioned more potential traffic to their respective pages. Once again, thank you all for watching, thank you all for 500 plus subscribers, and thank you all for spreading the word, you guys are just really awesome. Let nobody tell you otherwise. See you next time.